Welcome to our tour of OWL Practice's online intake and consent forms. This feature has been designed to streamline your client intake process. This tutorial will review all of the basics of online intake and consent forms. The timestamps for each section are listed here, so you can jump ahead to any part of the video anytime you need. Please feel free to revisit and view this video as many times as you wish. The Online Intake and Consent Forms feature is a part of OWL's client portal. This feature set includes both forms and online booking. The client portal is not included in the standard OWL plans. If you would like to use this feature, please contact us today by emailing support at owlpractice.ca to upgrade your plan. You can create, edit, and send forms from the Manage tab in your OWL account. The Manage tab is located in the left sidebar and can be accessed from anywhere within OWL. To create a new form, click on Manage. You will see a list of any forms already created by your practice here. Click the Add icon at the top right corner of the page to open the Forms Editor. Give the form a title. Then you can use the Form Actions toolbar on the far right side of the page to build the form. There are three options here that you can use to build your form. First, you can add questions. There are a variety of question types to choose from. You can make questions mandatory or optional. Questions can be made mandatory by using the Is Required option. You can also duplicate or delete questions as you go using the duplicate button or the trash can button. Next, you can add the OWL Intake module. The OWL Intake module lets your clients provide information about themselves. When the form is submitted, this information will be stored within the contact and clinical section of their OWL client record. This tool is optional, and you can select which fields you would like to use by clicking the checkbox next to the item. It is important to know that if you use the OWL intake module on more than one type of form, these fields will never auto-populate with client information already on file. So, if you decide to use it on both your consent and intake forms, the client will be required to submit this information twice. Once a client submits their form, the contact and clinical section of their OWL client record will automatically update to include the information they've submitted in the OWL intake module. If you have opted to let your clients type in their first name and last name, please note that doing so may change the name of this client within OWL possibly differing from the name in your records. The OWL intake module also allows your clients to choose their own reminder settings. Once they've selected their reminders, OWL will automatically deliver appointment reminders to the client following the same logic as if you had set them up under the client account. If you do not want to allow your clients to subscribe to their own reminders, or if you do not wish to use reminders, please ensure that you deselect the Reminders option from the OWL Intake module when you create the form. The third option is the Signature module. This module enables your clients to accept an explicit agreement with your practice based on your terms and policies by prompting their authorization on the form. The Signature module lets your clients digitally sign the form by typing their name and entering the date onto it once they have completed it and are ready to submit it to you. Most mental health professions require that the consent process happen in a face-to-face -face discussion with clients. Please be mindful that any online consent processes you create with an OWL should work in tandem with your verbal consent processes. When you are ready to save the form you have created, click the green Save Form button. Please be sure to do this before you navigate away from the page so you do not lose any of your progress. You can come back and edit your form as many times as needed until it is complete. Just click the Edit button to open the Forms Editor. You can then edit and update your form as needed. Click the Close Editor button when you are done. Note that if you have sent the form and a client has already completed a question, you will no longer be able to edit that question. This is done to protect the integrity of your historical data. You can also send, duplicate, download PDF, deactivate, and delete forms by selecting them from the list and clicking the appropriate action in the green edit bar. 
When you send a form to a client through OWL, the form is sent as a custom link in an email. You can use the default client form message, or you can customize the content of your form emails. To do so, go into the settings and click into the online portal section. At the bottom of this page, you will see the client form messages. You can use the macros on the right, then build the content of your message in the email message area. Please note, you must use the forms macro to include the link to the form. If you do not use this macro, a link will not be included in the email to your client. Click the green Save button to update your work. You can customize the email message each time you send the form to your client, but a standard one is recommended. To send a form, your client must be entered into OWL with their first name, last name, and email address. If you do not yet have an email address on file for this client, you will not be able to send them the form. There are two places in OWL that a form can be assigned to a client, the Manage tab and the Client account. To send a form from the Manage tab, go into Manage. Click the checkbox next to the form you are ready to send. This will open the green edit bar. Click the gray Send button, then search for the client by their name. Click the green Send Form button to send it. To send a form from the client account, go into the client's account. In the left sidebar, click Send Form. Follow the prompts to select the form, the client email address, and customize the email message. Click the green Send Form button to email the form to the client. Clicking the Send Form button will deliver the form to your client as an email message. If the client has not yet received the form, they may need to check their junk or spam folders. As we've already mentioned, when you send a form to a client, it will be delivered to them as an email, which includes their unique form link. This link will redirect the client to the client portal, where they will be prompted to complete the form. Here's an example of how it will look for a client's email. The client will click the link and then complete the form. Your client's progress is auto-saved every five seconds from the moment they start typing into the form. Any time a client would like to work on their form, they can open the email and click on the link within to resume. However, once they click Submit, they will not be able to make any changes to the form details again. If needed, you can always reassign a form to a client. We highly recommend setting yourself up as a test client to see exactly what your clients will experience before you begin sending them forms. As soon as you send a form to your client, it will appear under the Documents tab in their client account. You can open the form and view their progress at any time. To view a form, go into the client account and click on Documents. You'll see the form listed here. Click on the eye icon to open a preview. You can review the areas of the form the client has completed so far. Once a client has signed a form, you will receive an email to let you know that it is complete. You can review the completed form in the document section of the client's record at that time. If you have used the OWL intake module, the contact and clinical area will also be updated to include the client supplied information. Online intake and consent forms has limited access based on user type for groups, as with the rest of OWL. Practice owners and office admins can access the Manage tab and therapists cannot. This means that practice owners and office admins will be responsible for designing, updating, and managing the practice's forms. Therapists will be able to send forms as needed from within the client account. Thanks for taking a tour of OWL Practice's online intake and consent forms. Please visit our site, owlpractice.ca, or send an email to support at owlpractice.ca to get started on your very own forms today.